Lee Hogan here, VIP TV, down here to Oldham Leisure Centre with Lyndon Arthur. Lyndon, big announcement to make, innit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I'm turning pro. So, so that feels like it's about time now. It's about time. Well, I mean, when did Zelfa turn over? Was that almost three years ago? Yeah, is it that long? That's it. It sure must be close to that, I mean, two and a half years or yeah, something. About around, around about that time, around that. Um, but you've been busy down with the yeah, England squad. I've done, a lot, I've, done a lot, I've done a lot more than anybody thought I would as an amateur with mm. this title. Um, I got on a GB squad, which was brilliant. Plus, you fought on that World Series, which, World Series which actually is, is a great sort of like yeah. stepping stone for you because you were doing five, yeah, three five minute rounds five, three. against some of the best fighters yeah, in the country. Yeah, These yeah. are probably better Mexican, fighters. Than he was a silver medalist in the Mexican game, that, or Mexican ABAs, if that's the yeah. thing, I don't know. But he was a silver medalist. He was good, he was a good opponent. Was I thought you won that one. I thought I won it. A lot of people thought I won it, but what can you do? I, I enjoyed it. I enjoyed it a lot, mm -hmm. a lot more than any fight I've ever been in. The but five rounds and you wasn't picked fight. for the Olympics, were you? Right? No, no, no. Joshua Bowatsi fought also in the ABA final a couple of years ago. He's a great fighter. I feel like yeah. he got a medal over there as well. Um, he was my friend down on the teammate, down on the GB. We were like, with everyone that's going. So I had to wish all them um, the best of luck as well. Because I feel like. We're, we're taking a 12 man uh, squad, aren't we? It's the biggest squad that they took in so many years or something. And there's a lot of fighters down there that I feel like won a medal. And they were brilliant. And so, what are you going to turn over as? I mean, are you going to be like heavyweight? What? Yeah, I'm I mean, because like you're going to be like heavy. I don't, yeah. I, don't, I, don't, I don't think I'll make super medal. I don't ever think I'll attempt to make super medal. No. no, no. What, what age are you now? Are you 24? 25, are you? 25, just turned 25 last week. Yeah, so it's perfect age for you because yeah, you, you know, another couple of years, you should be just coming into your peak and yeah. hopefully ready for, as we were talking before. Uh, I'm pretty sure that within 10 fights, you could be British title material I, easy. Yeah, I feel yeah. like that as well. Um, Exciting, exciting, exciting. I tell you what, it's uh, uh, going to be a very, very exciting place, your Jim. Yeah, 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 I mean, the quality it's, it's that get, you've got it's there. there now with myself, Zelfa, Twin, Chris Munn, uh, 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 everyone, Ben Mulligan, uh, everyone that's coming out of the gym, it's, 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 it feels like it's on the way back to how it used to be. Yes. Um, just so many years ago with the Quigs and the Reese Roberts and everyone else, Tommy McAllis, Michael Jennings, and Matthew Orr, <laughs> Bobby Reed, oh, you know, three-time world champions. All these ongoing champions from our gym, so I feel like that's going to get back there in the next few years. In the next few years. Right, well, I'll be looking forward to seeing this. Yeah. Have any idea where this might be? It's I definitely in September. Wherever it, wherever it gets made, I'm there. Wherever it gets, I don't know anything about it yet, so... Well, we'll be down there and come and see you all, because, like I say, it's a... It's a very, very exciting place and very happy in gym, yeah, mate. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Lyndon, take care, mate. Bye-bye.